Hi, my name's Ed Goins, and I'm a lawyer. And when people hear that for the first time, they hear lawyer, and they immediately go, oh, Lord, a lawyer. But I always say that I'm a fun lawyer because I'm a lawyer for sports, for professional sports teams. My title is General Counsel and Senior Vice President of Government Affairs for the Seattle Seahawks. Uh, the National Football League team. For those who don't know sports, um, you may have heard of our our star our star quarterback, which most people have heard about, a guy named Russell Wilson, um, and then if not, maybe his talented wife uh, Sierra. So I work with those guys along with hundreds of others to run the Seattle Seahawks. Um, the Seahawks, like any other company, any other sports team. It's a business. Um, it's uh, owned formerly by uh, deceased now, Paul Allen, who was a um, early, um, he was a founder of Microsoft along with Bill Gates. Um, so a little bit about the Seahawks, uh, in case you don't know, um, professional football team, as most people would know, um, founded in 1976, and we've won one Super Bowl and have gone to three. Um, and hope to go to many more. Um, the, as I said, the Seahawks, we're, we're a business, and so people wonder many times, what does a lawyer do uh, for a pro football team? And I always say, a lot. Um, and being a lawyer, being a business person, um, for any business, there's quite a bit of work to do. So for us, and for the Seahawks, we not only own the the sports team, we also uh, run and operate the venue, the, um, the stadium, along with an event center. So I do tons and tons of contracts um, for our, our sponsors and for event promoters, um, for concerts. Um, we had many concerts lined up this year, but they were um, canceled because of the, the COVID-19 virus, but we have hundreds and hundreds of events um, every year. So I have a team of lawyers uh, who uh, work for me, who put together our contracts, who make sure that we're all protected um, and make sure that all the rights and responsibilities are clear. So that's a lot of what I do, but I also do, um, beyond that, I do so, so many other things, but there's employment and labor issues. Um, we deal a lot with government relations, um, uh, deal with crisis management, uh, essentially whatever the business needs, it needs a good lawyer. Uh, typically, uh, most folks think of lawyers as, as, as in the courtroom arguing it out, but most lawyers that I deal with and, and myself included, we're business lawyers. So we are negotiating, understanding what the risks are, um, just making sure that the deal gets done in such a way that makes sense for everybody. So that's what I do. I love it. I think it's a um, great career. I um, People ask me all the time, how did I get into sports? Like, how did I get a land a job in sports? So many folks love sports. And so it's really hard to get into, but they they like to know, you know, what path did I take? And I always tell them that, I got into sports uh, through a muffin, <clears throat> excuse me, through a muffin. And everyone laughs and goes, well, what do you mean a muffin? Um, I went for an informational interview with the general counsel of Major League Soccer when it was first starting. And I, um, every morning before going to work, I'd always get me a muffin. And this morning I was going to go see her for the informational interview. And so I got a muffin for her as well. And we sat down and had breakfast together and I got to learn about what she does for, for work. She was happy to talk to me about it. It wasn't a job interview, um, but it was very uh, conversationalist, conversational. And so um, a month or so later, uh, a, a position opened up in her company and she remembered me and the muffin and our conversation. I came back for a real job interview. Um, I got the job and that's how I got into sports. So I would say that the lesson I learned there is be yourself, be kind, um, be professional, be on time, and you'll get the job you want. So thank you for allowing me to talk to you and have a great day.